If you got it, it ain't a question Oh, it ain't no more for guessing No more than emotionally investing Showing you all my imperfections oh, If I let you take me for Hi guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome to my channel i am car j and here we get into everything beauty fashion lifestyle related with lots of hauls on this channel so if that's something you're interested in please subscribe down below and don't forget to turn on your post notification bell that way you don't miss a video from your girl okay so i feel like i forgot the intro y'all but yeah i haven't done a sit down video in so long i feel like it's been what a month and a half your girl has been in her vlogging era. Like, I've really been trying to put out vlogs for 2024. So, yeah, we're back with a sit, a sit down video. And I'm going to be doing a what's in my bag. A what's in my bag. I felt like I said that weird. But, yeah, I'm going to show you guys what I keep in or what I have in this bag. Um, I just recently got it. If you see my last vlog, I unboxed this bag. Um, but, yeah, this is the Cassie 19 by coach this is their denim collection and i absolutely fell in love when i seen their that they came out with a denim collection this is kind of unique for my um collection i guess you could say as far as luxury purses go i don't have a denim bag so i felt like i needed it and honestly i love it the only thing i don't like about it is how small it is as you can see it's very stuffed with all of my stuff so on an everyday basis i don't feel like i would use this bag um, but for going to concerts or anything like that, because I don't carry much, I, I would use this bag. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much why I got it, was to wear it with my outfit for the Nicki Minaj concert. And yeah, so I'm going to show you, I guess, what's in this bag concert edition. Um, I would say... If you're going to a concert and you know you're going to be standing, girl, put on the crossbody. Uh, I feel like you should wear a crossbody bag when going to a concert. That way you don't ever have to put your bag down and it's just like on you. But right now I have the top handle strap. Um, it did come with a crossbody strap. Um, and then it came with a chain as well. I kind of have the chain tucked in the back just because it was making too much noise on the table in front of me. But, uh, yeah, that's the chain. I just like it to hang down, and it just gives the bag, like, a different look. But, yeah, this is what it looks like, if you haven't seen it. It has a back pocket in the back, and then it has, like, um, a twist mechanism to open it. Um, it does have the dog tag that says Coach on the side. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get into what's in it. So, you just turn it like that, and it pops right open. This is what... Let's see if I can show y'all. This is what the inside of my bag is looking like. As you can see, it's full to the top, girl. So I can't really put anything else in here. Um, let me try to open it so that I could just pull stuff out. Because with this bag, the, sh the um, flap just, it won't stay. So it's hard to like show what's in my bag. So I just put it like that so it would stay. Okay, so the first things I'm going to show you are in the front pocket, and we're going to start with my lip combo I'm actually wearing right now. So this is what I'm wearing, and this is what I have been wearing for a very long time. It is my go-to lip combo, okay? So I have a lip liner. This is NYX lip liner in the shade brown. It just says brown. This is my favorite lip liner, you guys. I actually have a backup of this somewhere in another purse i can't find it right now but as you can see this is actually my backup because i haven't even took off the plastic fully um so got that and then i pair it with uh nyx soft matte lip cream and i believe it's cotto i don't know how to pronounce it y'all but i think that's what it how you say it that is the shade and it's like a nude a really light nude color love that and i like that it's not drying on the lips it's a moussey consistency so it really feels good on the lips it's not like a regular uh, liquid lipstick which dries your lips out so i love that one i definitely recommend that um actually i think a lot of people know about that because i can never find it when i go to ulta it's always sold out so when i see it i try to get backups of it. Um, I, then i go in with a lip gloss um usually i just grab any kind of lip gloss i like um, the consistency of but this one's one of my favorites as well it's elf 
um, lip plumping glass in the shade Pink Cosmo. I actually like the one called Peach Bellini as well. But I have this one. I need to put on some right now, y'all. But yeah, that combo just hits. I just love that combo. And you guys have asked me in previous videos what I was wearing on my lips. Usually it's this. Okay, so the next thing I have in here is another lip product because I'm always going to keep multiple lip products in my bag. But this is the one from Summer Fridays and it's in the shade or, I don't know, flavor Vanilla Beige. But so far, this is my favorite um, scent or flavor, whatever. I love this one. Okay, and then next thing I have is a must-have for sure, and that is lash glue. Um, this lash glue is new for me, you guys. I just got this one off of Amazon. Um, usually, I'll just pick any lash glue that has, um, like, a brush to it to put in my purse. Um, so I really don't care which one I get, but I love the packaging of this one. This one's by Kiss. Um, so yeah, I just got this one. I usually wear the duo glue, um, but this is just in case my lash, my lashes start to fall off. I have something just to put it back on, girl, and this is a must in my purse. I cannot go without this. Um, so yeah. Okay, so next thing I have is some blotting papers, I believe they're called. Um, I actually got these from Forever 21. Uh, I usually don't have these in my purse, but I was standing in line trying to check out, and I seen that they had these. And you guys know um, summer is almost here. We're in spring right now, but summer is around the corner. And when I wear makeup, I get really oily during the summer, so these come in handy um, to just blot like the oil off my skin. So yeah, I love the packaging because it's really slim and it fits in my purse. Okay, and then I have some feminine products. One being this panty liner from the brand Cora. I got these from Target. And honestly, I don't like these panty liners. But these are so short. They just bundle up in your underwear, so I don't really like them. And then I have a tampon. It's also a little like small I don't know the brand of this one and then I have some feminine wipes I've talked about these before in uh, what's in my bag video these are the honey pot ones the sensitive ones so they don't have like a scent to them so these come in handy for when I need to go to the restroom in public because I don't like to use um, toilet tissue in public I don't know you know who's been touching it and stuff like that so me and my daughter will use these when we're in public so I got two of those. And then I have Benadryl. This is a must for me because um, one time I had went to my job, which I work for the post office and I worked in a warehouse. And I randomly broke out in hives and I didn't have Benadryl, or Benadryl on me. And I wish I would have because I had to go home that day. Um, but I broke out in highs. I don't know if I was allergic to the atmosphere. I don't know if I was allergic to something that was in somebody's package. But girl, I was embarrassed. So I went home. And ever since then, I keep Benadryl in my bag. And I like these little packets. They come with two tablets. Okay, and then the last thing. Let me see. Yeah, the last thing in the front pocket is some gum. Usually I'll have the whole pack of gum in my purse. But like I said, this purse don't hold much. So I just put like one or two pieces. This is Orbit. I don't remember what flavor it is, um, but for the most part, I like all their like mint flavored um, gum. That's my favorite gum. Okay, and then going on to the back pocket. So this is what the bag is looking like now. I have my hand sanitizer. This is um, one that I've talked about before. And this is Bath & Body Works Mahogany and Vanilla. I'm a vanilla girl, so this smells so good to me. And I'm always going to repurchase this. I really like Bath & Body Works um, hand sanitizers. Okay, and then next thing I have is a mini deodorant. This is the one by Native. Uh, this is in the scent Coconut Vanilla. It smells really good, you guys, but I've talked about this before, and I told you guys, this is really in my bag for just aesthetics. Um, I wish I could find my deodorant in a small package like this. I just love the packaging. Um, actually, my son uses this. Um, one time, he forgot to put on deodorant, and I had this on my 
and I had this in my bag and it wasn't used so I'm like here son you can use this so ever since then he really this is really like his deodorant um so yeah that's that I do not recommend native at all I do not like it y'all I think it's kind of overhyped to be honest but if you like it you like it I'm just not a natural deodorant girl I haven't hopped on that bandwagon yet but anyway next thing is some eye drops I carry eye drops because one, we're in spring going into summer and I have really bad allergies. Um, so my eyes get red, my eyes water, things like that. I start sneezing, girl. So I need to carry eye drops. Um, sometimes in the winter, I'll have allergies as well, but it's more in like the spring and summer time that I have, you know, my eyes um, freak out on me. So love to keep, you know, eye drops and I like these clear eye ones because they really do work with um, getting rid of the redness of course I have some lotion this is from Bath and Body Works I really just threw this one in my bag it doesn't go with the perfume that I'm going to show you guys in my bag but it's just a hand lotion just to put on so my hands aren't dry it smells good this is the scent um, Coco Paradise I don't even know if they have this scent anymore but I really I guess you could say collect these little hand creams just so that I always have one to put in my bag but yeah my hands are dry so I needed to put some on but love this it, it does smell good okay and then next thing is my perfume this is a rollerball perfume that I got from Victoria's Secret I just recently discovered this one it's T's Coco Soror Sor Sor I don't know how to pronounce it y'all but that's what it looks like um so yeah i just recently discovered this one during their semi-annual sale and i end up buying the rollerball the lotion as well as two girl two of the 1.7 ounce bottles and i already used one up and i brought those in january i think so love this scent this is my new favorite this is the one i'm wearing today Mhm. Mm yeah, you need to try that if you haven't tried it. I think it's odor. I might be last person to try that, but girl, if you haven't smelled it, you gotta go smell it at Victoria's Secret. Okay, the next thing I have is a must. It's Tylenol. I carry Tylenol on me at all times. I have um, migraines. I think it's because I'm anemic, and then again, it could be because I don't drink that much water. I try to drink as much water as I can because I definitely don't like having headaches, but sometimes I slack at drinking water because i i'm picky on my water i don't know if that's weird or whatever but i'm picky on the type of water that i drink um i really do love smart water so if i don't have smart water it's hard for me to drink it drink water so yeah i believe i get migraines from that but nevertheless i need to have tylenol if i felt just a little bit of a headache coming on I take me one of these. So, next thing in the back pocket is my Gots to Be glue. This is for um, brow and edge edges. It's like a gel, and then it has a like a mascara wand on the end of it. I like to um, do my edges. I like to um, do my baby hairs, and I like them to lay down, girl. I don't want them to move. But if they do, I always like to carry this in there just to fix it up or whatever i do recommend this if you do your baby hairs or whatever um this is really good i don't really use it for my brows i know that like laminate brow trend is big but personally i don't like that trend so i don't use it for my brows but you can definitely use it for your brows as well okay so last thing i have in here is my wallet this is the wallet that matches the bag so i got these um, I bought these together. Now they don't come together. The wallet is separate, but I had to get them both. One thing about me is I like my wallet to match my purse. It messes with my OCD or whatever when they're two different colors. I don't know, girl. I was looking in there to see if I had anything else. Um, I really don't put anything in that back pocket, but there is that zipper pocket right there. Um, so yeah, this is just my wallet, just typical wallet or whatever. Um, I have my cards in there and everything also has a zipper in the back so that you can put um coins I guess coins or maybe even some cash in the back I love this I just feel like it's too big for the purse I wish they would have um had a matching card holder instead 
Oh my god, y'all. I freaked out. I was like, what is that sound? We have a turtle. I was trying to figure out what that sound was, but he's in water right now. So I guess he's making like some kind of noise in the water. I was like, what the hell is that? Yeah, we have a turtle. My kids have a turtle. So that's what that is. But anyway, yeah, I wish they would have made a card holder instead of this. I feel like it's just way too big. I'm going to show y'all like in the bag. It takes up most of the room. Y'all see that? I don't understand that, but I do have this Amazon, uh, what is it called, purse organizer inside. I don't know if you'll be able to tell. It's black. I don't want to take it out because it's uh, too big for the bag, and I just, like, stuffed it in there because I definitely need an organizer for my bag so that my bag doesn't get dirty. Okay, so next thing is the bag pocket. So I'm going to pull out what is in there. And it is this right here. You're probably like, what is that, girl? If you don't know, these are foldable flats. I actually wore heels to the Nicki Minaj concert. And I know you're like, why would you wear heels? You're standing all the time. Yeah, but with my outfit, I feel like heels would went better. So I did wear some heels. They weren't too tall, girl. And I wasn't really struggling in them until I had to walk a block, get my lift, and in the cold and walking in heels a block and a half to get to my lift was not convenient for me so i'm glad i had these and i was smart about it so yeah foldable flats i got these off of amazon they're not that cute but they're definitely com more comfortable than you know heels um these have like the rubber backing and you don't have to worry about slipping and sliding but yeah i'm not into like flats i know it's a trend right now but for if I have to take off my heels or whatever, I have these to just throw on. I'm not about to walk barefooted, girl. No. Uh-uh. So, yeah, that is definitely a must-have, I feel like, if you're going to a concert. Um, and I wasn't the only one to wear heels. I'm so glad because I thought I was going to be the only one in heels. But a lot of people wore heels to the concert. So, if you're one of those girls, get you some foldable flats. That's all I have in the back pocket and then i just want to talk about my phone um i usually have my phone in my hand but if i go shopping or something like that um i put my phone in my purse but i definitely have my phone with me uh like we all do but this is the case that i have on it right now and this case is from velvet caviar this is my favorite case at the moment matter of fact velvet caviar is one of my favorite um, case brands um, so yeah, this is the body case. I have the case as well as the MagSafe grip. So it just magnetizes to the back. And then I have their um, phone charm as well. It's just the white one with the hearts on it. And I like this. It's a cute little match. And this is the iPhone 15 Pro Max. Now, if you do have like a smaller phone than I do, you might be able to fit it in the back pocket um see how mine sticks out because i have the iphone 15 pro max it's, it's the bigger version it doesn't fit in there i may be able to like push it in there maybe not no i don't think it'll fit but if you have a smaller phone than i do it'll probably fit in the back just letting y'all know if you want to um put your phone in the back pocket but yeah that is all that i want to show you guys that i have for this what's in my bag video I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I know this bag is sold out, but I looked on the website the other day and it said that they're coming back in July. So I'm going to have my, my notifications on or whatever so that I can get notified when that bag comes in stock because I do want the Tabby 20 in the denim collection. So yeah, if you are interested in getting this bag or if you've seen it and you're like, girl, that's cute. I want it. They may be coming out with it again in july but right now they're sold out so i just felt like i needed to say that to my girls but yeah that's all i have for this video you guys i really hope you enjoyed i will catch you guys in the next video and i love you bye